two decades now, AM radio has been on the decline thanks to FM radio and streaming apps like Sirius XM and Spotify. This year, several automakers have also announced plans to remove AM radios from electric cars. CBS 7's Tyler Poglich spoke with AM 550 earlier today to discuss more about the importance of AM radio and what's going to happen to the century-old media outlet. Tyler? For most Americans, you don't typically think about using AM radio thanks to the evolution of Bluetooth. But when there's an emergency, AM radio is there to make sure you are updated on the latest news. Good morning and welcome to the morning drive. AM radio has been around as long as Chris Moore has been on air. On a whole, your AM formats are either all, they're more talk. They're all sports or all conservative news radio. But now, thanks to apps like Spotify and Sirius XM, getting your sports talk or news using AM radio is becoming a thing of the past. When they're listening to the music, I think the music side is what caused the change more than anything. Whether it's been the introduction of FM radio, satellite radio, or Bluetooth radio, for president of ICA radio Barry Marks and the 80 million Americans that listen to AM radio, the idea of AM radio going away is nothing new. But AM just won't go away because it's too convenient and it's too universal and there's been too many uh, legacy stations built around AM broadcast. This time the reason AM radio is threatened is because it can cause technical interference with electronics in the cars. So lawmakers on Capitol Hill are stepping in with a bill to keep AM radio inside of the cars. Uh, because when there's power failures, uh, guess what? Cell cellular networks go down. Uh, many, many times broadcast is, is uh, continuing to operate because it's a one central location that has to operate and then it can push out the signal over hundreds of miles. Um, it's the only technology that does that and nothing pushes further than AM uh, radio. On a whole, your AM station, you know if something goes sideways, your AM people are going to be there live. The bipartisan agreement to make sure AM stays in cars will be voted on in the next coming days. For CBS 7 First Alert News, I'm Tyler Poglich.